right now at five. <laughs> it's the video that set up a steal for the Miami Dolphins at the NFL draft and set up a storm of speculation over hacking and even blackmail. Unfortunately, Laramie uh, had an allergic reaction this afternoon, so right now he's with uh, our medical staff. And that's just the start of what's become a draft drama. And Laramie Tunsil right there, apparently over his allergic reaction and speaking to reporters at Dolphins camp. Let's listen in. Man, because like I said before, it's a blessing just to be here, man, just to be in the NFL, just to be a part of his organization. I'm just here to talk about the Miami Dolphins. Laramie, obviously the Dolphins uh, were comfortable in, in taking you and drafting you. Other teams maybe were frightened away. What are your thoughts about the Dolphins being willing to step up and show their faith? You know, they gave me a chance, and I'm going to show them, you know, why I'm a best player. I should be in the draft. Laramie, did you learn anything about the uh, dangers of social media? Because without that post on Twitter, you probably would have been drafted one or two or three or something like that instead of 13. Like I'm saying, man, I'm blessed. Do you know anything about Ryan Tannehill? Have you ever seen him play much? Nah, but he takes me yesterday, man. So that's exciting just to just know he got my back. I mean, I know you addressed this before, but again, fans may have a question about your character after seeing that video and reading the text messages. What would be your message to them? No, no character issues at all. All right, we'll take the last one here, Armando. Ryan Tannehill has been the most sacked quarterback. I'm coming in here to help the team any way I can. Great. Thank you very much. We'll take one photo. And that is Laramie Tunsil. He was the number 13 pick in the draft last night uh, for the Miami Dolphins. He had been projected to go much higher. But the story, and perhaps you've heard of it, is just before the draft began, a video surfaced on Laramie Tunsil's own Tweet Twitter account, a verified account that showed him smoking what looked to be right marijuana. These are pictures of him last night, and this is the video that shows him smoking marijuana. Again, he admitted that it was him. He said the video was a couple of years old and that somebody hacked into his Twitter account and posted that video against his will. He had been projected to go a lot higher in the draft.